Okay, welcome back. I've done a bit of rearranging while I've been away. Uh, yes, I have moved several lockers against this wall. Most of them were in here. Uh, I got some from other rooms as well. I've put all of my loot in there. It's a little bit irritating that I have to stand next to them to see what's inside them, but that's alright. And yeah, I just... I got annoyed at the lockers blocking my line of sight, so... I started dragging them up to the other walls. I probably won't use these, but... Oh, I just see a bit of wall poking through there. Uh, and yeah, I grabbed some display racks from other rooms as well, just to cover up these windows. And uh, yeah, so I'll have to use the front door instead of just hopping out of a window. Uh, one thing I discovered while I was moving lockers, there was two over here. Now they did mention something about a basement when I was talking to these NPCs. But uh, yeah, there were two lockers there blocking this door, so I'm wondering why. And we're going to find out. Uh, I'm in desperate need of food and drink currently. Uh, yeah, I've got a bit of drink. Uh, that's... nope. That locker there is where I'm keeping all my empties. There we go. Uh, so I'm going to get myself a gun, I guess. I'm not, a, not exactly sure which gun I should use. But yeah, I've got a hand press and die set and... Maybe I should use... <laughs> pneumatic spear gun. Uh, it's four rounds. Hmm. Okay, I picked up a shotgun. I've picked up the L12 Defender. It carries uh, 12. All right, yeah, I have to reload it one at a time. It carries eight uh, shotgun doodads and other numbers and stuff. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I've got an L201 Enforcer. L2031. You insert a cartridge. Oh god. I have to reload both of them one at a time. But yeah, I wanted to get some guns because I do not know what's in this room, but I do know what this game is like. If a room is blocked off, there's probably something utterly horrible in there. So, yeah. Let's go find out. And I'm sure this guard here will give me a helping hand. Uh, are you okay there? Roll. Wielding a sawn-off shotgun. Right, I've got to watch my back then. That door is locked. Well, I believe I can do something about that. Yeah, so we have a crowbar. Oh boy! Okay. Uh, well, hello there. There's a child in there. Uh, yeah. Yeah, there's a few zombies in here. Just a few. Okay, let's turn safe mode off. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and stand here. And now you have seen them. <laughs> no, don't shoot the NPC. What the hell? Ah, they're dead. I think we can handle this, though. They're just normal zombies. We both got shotguns. No, don't shoot the NPC. Uh, nice. Okay, this, uh, this shotgun's pretty good. I like it. I will let them get, uh, closer, though. I'll let the NPC waste their ammo before I waste mine, I suppose. If they get close to me, though, I will shoot them. Because I don't want to get hurt. Oh, boy. Okay, it's fine. We're fine. We have shotguns. But yeah, there's actually another one of these rooms. I uh, I discovered two of them. Rooms with lockers blocking the door. Oh boy. Wowzers. Okay, this is quite a few zombies. But none of them have managed to hurt me yet. And this shotgun is ridiculous. 118 damage. Wow. Okay, let's reload it while they're shooting them dead. Okie doke. And I think we're whittling them down. Bloody hell, there's a lot of them. Was that food? It looked like food. <laughs> I'm very hungry. Uh, yeah, it's a can of tuna fish. Mmm. Let's just eat that in the middle of the battle. Hey! A zombie bites your left leg. Son of a bitch. How did it get close enough? You're not doing your job, guard. Uh, I'm glad that they're not, like, really pissed off at me for opening this door. Although, who knows? <laughs> it might be. Once we've killed them all. I think we're down to the last two. Yeah, there we go. Your healing wound feels painful. I know, I know. Wow. Okay. 
That was crazy. Is there any food in here? It was probably just a bunch of clothes, right? Yeah, just a bunch of clothes. Some pants, checkered pants. Mittens, what's that? Tank top. No, I don't think there's any food in here. What's this room? Oh, it's a bathroom. Okay. Uh, a pork pie hat. Nice. And a bra. So, yeah, that was fun. Ooh, we got another little room here. It's just got some jackets in it. And a trench coat. So, uh, I guess we should butcher these zombies. At least just so that they eventually rot away. The little bits of meat will rot away. Just notice there's some crates out there. I haven't opened. Wow. <laughs> there's a lot of zombies. Okay. Butcher, butcher, butcher. I got a wristwatch there. I think I already have one. I'll go through all this pile of crap later and figure out what I want. Uh, what have you got? Ooh, stuff. Can I eat a ravioli? Yes. So I just can't remember if I gave myself uh, a wheat allergy or not. Come on. There we go. Spray can. A knitted hat. Uh, I'm pretty sure I gave myself a wool allergy. I did, yes. Never mind. Uh, let's take this flu shot. Where is it? Do -do -do. There we go. You feel tough. I am tough. I just killed many, many zombies. Come on. There we go. Oh, yes. Lovely meat soup. Uh, I already have popular mechanics. Emergency blanket. Space age materials. Yes, we are in the space age. <laughs> uh, okay. Bandage, beans. Oh, yes. This is beautiful. Oh, I needed a hammer as well. That's great. So, I'm going to grab this fire extinguisher as well. It's always something I never get. And, like, I'll probably eventually build a fireplace in here. And it would be nice to have a fire extinguisher. <laughs> Okay, uh, let's drop the hammer and the fire extinguisher in my tools cupboard. Let's eat this soup. Really? Oh, yeah, go ahead. Oh, wow. Fully slaked and stuff. Uh, that's my thingy cabinet there. Uh, I'll keep hold of the food we're carrying at the moment. Let's reload this. Go ahead and wield my broadsword. But uh, actually, oh, it's getting a bit dark, isn't it? But yeah, where was that other room? There was another one. It had, uh, what's in here? All oh, right, that's the outside world. There was definitely another room. Whoa! What's going on there? A simple flamethrower. What's, is this, uh, oh, it's reinforced glass. An NPC just died in there. What, there's a door? No, there's no door. It's just that metal door which I can't open. I have tried. You can't crowbar them. Nothing to pry there. Uh, where the hell is that other room? Is it in here? No, that's the one with the gaping hole in it. Ah, there it is. Yeah, I haven't moved the lockers. I think it's the same room though, actually, isn't it? Um, let's just drag that out the way. Yeah, it just looks like it's the same room. Oh, no, there's a metal door there. Yeah, I'm going to have to get an acetylene torch to cut through those doors, I think. Because I don't think there's a way through them otherwise. But it looks like night is ascending upon us, or descending upon us, if you will. So I'm going to try and get this uh, guy to sleep. And then we'll go on some adventures in the morning, I think. And we wake up, and we have finally got rid of the bloody healing wound. Why is my mouth so encumbered? What am I wearing? Uh, yeah, I'm wearing quite a lot of stuff on my torso, which only amounts to two encumbrance. That's not bad. Uh, just got a cotton hat. I need a proper helmet at some point. Right, I'm wearing a filter mask and two bandanas. I should take off the filter mask. Uh, yes, good stuff there. That looks good. Loincloth. Why am I wearing a loincloth? Yeah, my sheath still has 
a steak knife in it for no reason. Uh, I mean, I've got a butcher knife in my inventory, but uh, let's get the mouse out of the screen there. Right, so we're pretty hungry. Having woken up, yeah, we've eaten the last of our food, and I gotta get used to which lockers have which stuff in now. Right, okay, uh, let's have a look at the town. Now, I left a bunch of stuff in... was it this hardware store? I think so. Yeah, there was a lot of useful stuff there that I think I wanted to go back for. Uh, that's nothing useful. I mean, got a gas station. Wildlife field office. There is another town over this way. Which has military surplus. Uh... Yeah, some good stuff over there, but I think I would rather concentrate on this town first. So, I think we'll just generally go around uh, looting stuff. Yep, yeah, I think we'll go to the restaurant first. Because we need some food and drink, and there's possibly some in there. And yeah, eventually I may swap my lockers for these display racks. Because, um... You can actually see what's inside them. Like if I if I lose something, um, I don't know why I'm dragging this wheelbarrow. I could take one of these vehicles and have a hell of a lot more storage. But oh, a squirrel! I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, stupid squirrels. Okay, well, let's cook your meat then. What? That's a shrub. What do you mean? There's nothing to light there. Fuck you. Hmm, this is a new development. No, don't make me do stuff to make fire. <laughs> Alright, let's just smash this tree then. It shouldn't be too much of a problem. Alright, uh, food. Oh, do I not have anything to cook stuff with? Uh, let's see if I can drag one of these sticks out of the fire. Yeah, don't ask me how I managed to do that. I <laughs> guess I don't know. Right. Uh, cooked meat. There we go. And delicious roasted squirrel for breakfast. And the fire's gone out. Oh, it is drizzling. I think I've turned the rain animation off, haven't I? I should turn that back on. They do look better now. Uh, options. Graphics. Rain animation. Yes. There we go. Yeah, it's uh, transparent now, so it looks better. Okay, off to the restaurant. Because, yeah, it is useful to know when it is actually raining, so... Uh, oh boy, here come the zombies. Whoa, okay. I hate the way the view shifts like that. It's disconcerting, to say the least. Right, I will stab you with a broadsword. Come on. On to the thing. Uh, do you have anything? Oh, you have more gun things. Okay. Uh... Actually, no, don't butcher the spitter zombie corpse. Because <laughs> I think it will just leave a puddle of acid and... Oh, shit. Let's cut myself on the window. I'll just smash it out of spite. Right, so... We probably got... Let's set this up. Yeah, we got some string and sheets here. I'll take them. Because we can use them for stuff. Glass. Yes, just glass. Uh, the kind of glass you drink out of, I guess. Uh, anything in here? It's a terrible restaurant. <laughs> There's some cocaine in the bathroom. Nice. That's always good to find. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Oh, is there anything in this back room? Ah, here we go. Here's the kitchen. Okay. Uh, yep. Or did I just take there? I think I took a string. Got some raw pasta. Uh, what is those things? Wood stoves. Can I grab those? You grab the wood stove. Nice. Hmm. I may just come back for one of those. Whoops. Because, yeah, that would be great. A ceramic plate. I'll take the curry powder. I do enjoy a good curry. Uh, raw potatoes. Mmm. Uh, Riesling. It's just horrible. Now, I don't know if these mushrooms are different from the mushrooms that you find spawning wild. But I'm going to leave them anyway, just in case. 
Uh, what was in that bottle there? Did I just leave something? Oh yeah, it's the Riesling. Ugh, horrible wine. <laughs> okay. So yeah, now I know there's wood stoves in there that I can... Whoa! Hello, zombie. <laughs> didn't expect that. Yeah, I can come back and get those. Uh, I'm going to set off this firecracker. Just for no reason. They go off really quickly, don't they? You hear bang. Did anything uh, hear that? No? Well, it doesn't look like it. Did something just smash through that window there? Oh, there's a skeletal dog coming at me. Come on. And now your bones. Let's go ahead and butcher it and eat the bones, I guess. That's just really gross, but, you know, it works. <laughs> Why not? Uh, nom. You can't eat your broadsword. Oops. Uh, I'm going to put nails on auto pickup. Alright. There we go. Nail added to auto pickup rules. And it's not letting me pick them up. Because I think the zombie dog is distracting me. Where is it? Uh, I don't know. It might just be that I've not set it up properly. I'll have a look in a minute. Just kill this guy first. Alright, can I pick them up now, please? Uh, no, I guess I just don't have auto pickup turned on. Auto pickup adjacent, right. Yeah, that's what I forgot to turn on. There we go. Nom 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 nom. Yeah, it's the best way of getting a load of nails. Burn a house down, turn auto pickup on. And just go for it. Yeah, if you have a shovel and you clear up these um, piles of rubble, you can sometimes get more nails from them. But uh, usually you just find the remnants of the destroyed furniture in there. Is there a body there? I will butcher it. Oh, it's a shocker zombie. Oh, I didn't have any CBMs. Lame. Right, okay. I think that's me hoovered off all of those nails. Right. Uh, where to next? A liquor store. Yeah, we'll go to the liquor store. Alcohol is very useful. Uh, what's that? Feral hunter. Now you are bits. Uh, where? Yeah, there's a few things down here though. Okay, the liquor store is just here, but... Uh, okay, we're gonna go ahead and get ourselves in this building. Let's grab this bookcase and shove it there. We'll stand here. That doesn't help at all, does it? <laughs> Can I shove it into the window? No. Oh well. Uh, come on, zombies. Ooh, okay, hello. And stab. Anybody else? Woo! I should probably put safe mode on if I'm just gonna spam wait a turn like that. Yeah, let's do it. Why not? Anybody else coming? Oh, there we go. Oh, god damn it. Do I have some stuff to get that off my eyes? No, unfortunately not. I wonder if a towel would work, actually. If I had one on me. I think I have several left at my shelter, but, uh... Ooh, Ambien. Delicious. Uh, anything else? Nope. Come on, guys. Yes, uh, I think that was all of them. Yeah, there is a zombie brute, which, um, what's the movement cost of this? It's the same as a window, so I might as well just use my wheelbarrow. Come on. Get on my wheelbarrow and stab. Your clumsy butchering destroys the meat, but my survival skill is now two. Oh god, I don't like this. I'm gonna take some cocaine, because... Yeah, I know what they're like. They'll chuck me halfway across the street. Stab, stab, and you're dead. Fuck you. Right. You're just running around in a shirt and some flip-flops. It's unfortunate. Uh, can I set fire to this guy's web? No. It's not flammable by itself. That's unfortunate. Uh, yeah, so let's actually go into the liquor store then. Which is here. It doesn't have any front windows. It's a bit weird. Alright, what's back here? 
Ooh, goodies. Uh, yeah, I'll take another fire extinguisher just in case the small one that I have isn't enough. Time to be overzealous. Rolling tobaccos. A refillable lighter, those are pretty cool. Ooh, a restaurant guide. What is that? Let's go ahead and activate that. You add roads and restaurants to your map. Uh, that's not the key. There it is. Right. So I can see the road network at least, and all of the restaurants nearby. Uh, you can also see bars and fast food places and stuff. It's uh, useful enough to know where the towns are and roughly what size they are. We seem to have a decent town density, but not all the towns are particularly huge, I gotta say. Oh well. Uh, please let me move. There we go. Uh, orange juice. Mm, sloppy Joe. Mm. Uh, can you get out of my way? Right, so I'm going to have to grab this and drag it out of the way. There we go. Right. <clears throat> yep, I think we'll just go ahead and take all of this. None of it's rotten at the moment. I did need food and drinks. Uh... Yeah, I'm tempted just to take the stuff that I know works in uh, making bandages. I'll take this fruit wine, though, because I think I can trade that at the uh, refugee center. Triple sec. Uh, some more fruit wine. Yeah, I think they said they would trade for home-brewed beer, but I don't know if they would trade for stuff that you just find lying around. But, uh, I mean, beer's pretty good, actually, because it uh, quenches your thirst, but, um, yeah, obviously you can't drink too much of it, for health reasons. Uh, yep, take all of those. Not really a big fan of IPAs anyway. Prefer stouts. There's plenty of stout in here, actually. Uh, whiskey? Ooh, lots of stuff over here. So yeah, just the hard liquor, gin, and the fruit wine to see if I can trade it for anything good. Although one of the traders managed to get themselves killed. I think it's possible that the debug uh, thing just killed them because they were doing weird stuff. It does happen. Their heads kind of explode. Uh, yep, lots of ales and stuff. Whiskey, vodka... Pinot Noir, Cabernet Sauvignon, right, that'll do, I think, we don't want to go crazy, we don't want to become an alcoholic, uh, okay, so I think next up I will go to the sporting goods stores and finish clearing out the hardware store, probably the hardware store first.